if nothing can escape black holes, then why don't they just suck up the entire universe? So it's like saying, if there is a very big fish, why doesn't it suck up the entire ocean? Right? So even if uh, nothing can escape a black hole, it doesn't mean it's going to suck up the entire universe. Right? A black hole is a certain size and it has a certain event horizon and it absorbs permanently or more or less permanently only something that crosses the event horizon. If something is outside the event horizon, it doesn't suck it up. The the black hole is not like a vacuum cleaner. It goes everywhere and sucks everything uh, inside. It's not like that. A black hole can sit in its corner of space time quietly for almost forever without ever coming into uh, whether without ever interacting with anything anything else if it is in such a location of space time where there is very less where there are very less uh, stars or galaxies around so um, so even if you look at the uh, supermassive black hole at the center of the milky way it's not really active it's not really sucking anything in it is an enormous supermassive black hole its mass is of the order of millions of times the solar mass and yet it's it's sitting quietly at the center of our galaxy it's not doing anything it is basically holding the galaxy together and it's not sucking in any matter because nothing is as far as we can see from here crossing the event horizon there are a bunch of stars that are very close to it and they are moving very rapidly because of the uh, proximity to this massive object and yet they are not, not being sucked in. They are simply orbiting the black hole. So a black hole is not necessarily something that's going to vacuum clean everything and suck everything in. It can just sit there essentially forever and not suck anything in, depending on where it is located.